welcome back to my channel guys if you're new to this channel go ahead and smash that subscribe button click the bell to be a part of the notification squad and guys if you want to be part of my paid channel membership the link is in the description bar it is a dollar and 99 cents to join you do have to be at least 18 years old to join that membership and basically that membership is just exclusive live streams behind the scenes updates the first to know just you know just a bunch of random stuff um but today i am officially introducing baby drew um i had decided that i would go ahead and get him completely done um get it out of the way get it out of my system um he is a baby that i have been waiting to paint this baby like forever ever ever and i know i've mentioned this in several videos and i know i put up a video and i took it down because i just decided that i just don't want to get back in that zone of just you know whoa 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 so um yeah so this is him i actually I'm pretty proud of myself. I think I took two, two and a half days to root him. And I know a lot of you guys probably, especially my customers are probably like, how come she does everything so fast when it's her own? <laughs> it's because I don't have the pressure of worrying if this is gonna be okay or that is gonna be okay or what if I miss this spot or what if I don't do this or what if it's not this? this way or that way I just can just go and it's just it just doesn't matter because it's mine so that's that um so I decided to go ahead and get that out the way um and I will be rooting like I for those that did catch a glimpse of that video I will be rooting um working on another project finish that one up but um Oh my gosh, where was I? Oh, so Andrew is the, uh, his, I kept the name Andrew. And I kept his name Andrew because um, I just like it. I've been calling him Andrew for the whole time. And like I said before, um, just in chatting with some of my uh, Dolly sis and stuff like that, Stacy, um, one of my... Uh, baby mamas I guess you could say <laughs> um was ca had called him Drew and I was like oh my gosh and it just stuck so sometimes you'll hear me say Andrew and sometimes you'll hear me say baby Drew and baby Drew and Andrew is one of the same his middle name is Matteo um his last name is Berrettini and he is his daddy is Matteo Berrettini the tennis player yes um <laughs> That uh, credit goes to uh, Birdie Babies that had me glued to the TV watching that man play or young man. Oh, child, he was real young. I didn't realize they flashed his age up on the screen. I felt I felt creepy. I was like, oh, my gosh, I didn't know. He didn't tell me his age. Anyway, child, listen, I'm going to get a pass. Just don't tell Miss Andy. Don't tell Miss Andy. But anyway, so um, Andrew is the uh, Andrew Scope by Mesa said, and I don't know. How you pronounce her name or whatever but that's how I say it and um he was poured by Maria Glo Grover I want to say Glover every time Grover I'm always messing up people name and he is the uh, marshmallow blend um which is so it's Equiflex 20 super soft and marshmallow blend and so he is the marshmallow blend and I really love my soft pour child y'all know I do um, so anyway, he's 17 and a half inches and they said he is five pounds, six ounces. Again, I have not put him on a scale. So I'm going to just turn him around so you guys can see him. And I know I'll probably like block the light a little bit. I will definitely get some photos. Um, he does have armatures and his armatures does seem to go all the way up his arm. And it's pretty cool because they kind of rotate upwards. So in previously when I first like open him up when he was blank I was like the armatures are kind of stiff but they're not the stiffest that I felt um I felt some that's been you know quite a bit more stiff but I actually have gotten used to them and I actually like them I don't have a problem with the armatures on him so he is poured in all one piece 
and yes he's the wrinkly blinkly and um he is so they call it you know everybody have their different stuff i think a lot of people say marshmallowy if it's like you know super soft he is like kind of memory foamy he's kind of like memory foam but his his memory foam don't go like this his memory foam go like memory foam <laughs> You know, you know, when people get the Claire Teller dolls, they be like, it's the memory foam in the room. And his is like the memory foam. <laughs> Let me stop. Anyway, child, listen. But um, yeah, so it has a little bit of a of a slow rise, but you know, it's not a quick spring back, but it's not like take forever to rise. But he feels so good. See, I feel so good, mama. Yes, I do. I love this little boy. Yes, I do. He sleep on the poppy on mama bed. Yes, he do. So, like I said, you have to support his, his head. His neck is definitely super wobbly. And like I said, he is definitely super soft. Super soft, super soft, super soft. And... So his head easily turned from one side to the next. So I don't know if you guys can wait. see. And then it turns this way easily. Ooh, baby. Ooh, baby. Sorry. But, um, yeah. So, yeah. So he is really, really a sweetie pie. So I think he mostly wear preemie clothes um i think he could probably fit a small newborn if it was carter's i should have brought a carter onesie just to see over here let me see if i have a carter's onesie but you know carter's depending on what state you in where you buy it from depending on the size now the carter's at the actual carter store their brand usually be the smallest for me but, um, they have seemed to change, have changed their brand size. Now, this is Loved Baby right here that he had on, and it's preemie. But their, it's, their sizes is kind of weird, because this is preemie, but this is, like, huge. And then this is preemie, but it's kind of, like, smaller. Um... Well, this is a different brand. But anyway, so, I don't know. I might put him on that. But let me see if I could grab a, if I have one really close by. You can just close it if I can spot one real quick. Oh, yeah, yeah. I will. Same light, like, which is aggravating. But I think, I, I really do believe that he could fit the, um, like a regular um, boy onesie. If it was um, just a regular Carter's, but I don't have one by me to do. So I am going to put him on. Uh, what are you going to put on? You already wore that. Maybe I'll put him back on this little preemie. Miss Perennity Sis. Miss Perennity Hits Me. <laughs> Miss Perennity. <laughs> um, one thing about him is that he's kind of chubby, even though he's he's um so he's 17 and inches, 17 and a half inches long. So he's got length. So I got length, mama. But he is still, you know, small, but he's not tiny, tiny, tiny. And he's chunky, so I think he could really fit but i'm gonna put him back in this because i had light time in this and he didn't get to wear it long because i i decided i was like let me just go ahead and root these old edges up in here get his boy some edges because it was driving me insane i have to keep putting him on a hat and listen baby i told y'all if i finished that last those last customs i needed me a break to to do me for a minute so i had to take me some time to really regroup 
and now I feel great yes honey I am feeling wonderful now that I have taken that break and painted some babies that I wanted to paint for myself and I got one totally completed which feels amazing and another reason why I took down that video is because I was thinking to myself I, I'm talking out of emotion saying I'm not gonna paint silicone da 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 to sell and that just you never know I just never know because I when I get it done and the fact that I feel like I can do this and complete it I don't know I'm thinking I might you know I don't have to bake um it is you know it is um risky um it is one of those mediums that you just really gotta be you know careful it is pricey especially if you're doing it as buy it nows which means you're buying the kits up front and then um and then um putting it up for sale Ooh, these socks do not match well i was finna well i was finna say boy i done found you some green socks but that's a no and then these my my little bottles i was sending these little bottles home with some of the babies at one point but i, I hadn't really sent them home but this little bottle i made i've been making my little bottles child listen Honey, baby, when you, listen, <laughs> when you, when you get to the point of where you can't keep up with the, the, the new news in the, um, what's going on, you start making your own stuff. Like, baby, let me, look, let me, let me make my own baby. Let me do this. Let me do that. Child, listen, I ain't mad with nobody. Cause baby. I done got over here and started trying to. Nah, Topher got mad with me about these socks. She was like, "Mommy, it's too hot for them socks." So maybe, maybe so, maybe she right. She was like, "It's too hot for them socks on him. I don't really like that outfit on him." Girl, stay off my Instagram. Ain't nobody asked your opinion. She be all up in Andrew business. She like Andrew. She was like, Mom, I know you. he's so because he looks so real. I'm like, uh, he is not for sale. Child, listen, your children, your family, your your boyfriend, your baby daddy, husbands, if you paint, they will sell your whole soul. They don't want you to think you're supposed to keep none of your churn. They be like, oh, how much you going to sell that one for? <laughs> um, We not. <laughs> Well, how much you gonna sell a lot one for? We not see he he gonna have to he have to have lube some lube to get this bottle in, and his mouth um is not like a it's open but it's not like a big opening so you have to like either modify his pacifier or you have to use like really small nipples and I'll probably like I said you have to make sure you use lubricant when you um. You know, bottle feed him or whatever. Um, he doesn't have a drinking wet, so it'll be fake feed all the way. But it don't really matter because his lips so cute. And I really won't be putting him on a lot of pacifiers, but I've already modified him a pacifier that works. So that's fine. Um, and if I want to bottle feed him, I will, you know, be able to do it too. I just... And I also found, I was looking online where I found some nipples that's got the skinnier thing. Um, because, where is that bottle? The one that I have here is one that got a really small nipple. It's actually, um, this is actually a clear teller bottle. But um, this is the size nipple that that you need, really. And I found where I could order some of these, I think. So I'm going to try to see if I could order these size nipples. And then, so these, like, I could probably easily get in. Yeah. And see, and if I had the lubricant, I could get it in even more so. But, yeah. That's the only thing I wish sculptors would really consider when they're making these kits is they actually consider the fact that we do like to 
role play and I know they be like this this is art this is not for this girl get these coins this what we this what we buy them for so listen cater to us like you cater to your man because we paying your bills I'm gonna need y'all to take that in consideration of things that we want <laughs> Um, but yeah, but I can appreciate that at least the mouth is open. He do got a little top gum. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. So anyway, he is a special little one for me. And, you know, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing him. Like I said, um, he is very flexible. <laughs> um, yeah, he, he will bend crazily. Say I will be in crazily aunties, but mama don't like doing all that with me. I don't like doing all that with me. So um, I'm so happy and so glad that I actually did go ahead and order this kit and paint it. I was being a doll snob, I will admit, and I was like, nah, I don't like this and I don't like that. But every time I would see this kit, I was just like, oh, I love him. Oh, I gotta have him. Um, I think the one that really made me fall in love with him was the one that Chrissy did. And I really, honestly, my, um, Drew was supposed to be a very light biracial. And, but I just, I got challenged to do it, you know, to paint him darker. And I went with it and I love his skin tone and I'm very happy with him. Um, he is just such a sweet baby. So I'm really, really happy. And so congrats to all the mommies that have the Andrews. Um, there's also, um, an Andrew Awake. Like, there's a Awake version of this. And I love, love, love that baby. If she had made any changes to the baby, it's, um, like the bum bum or, you know, just anything different. Um, like, you know, maybe I, she, maybe she opened the mouth up a little bit more. I don't know. But if she, she had gave it a little bit different body style or something different about it, I would have probably went for another one to paint, to have a, a twin to it. But I'm not going to paint another one. This is it for me. This is the only Andrew I will be painting. Um, and, but I am looking at another kit that I'm thinking about because I just want to paint it, but that's why I was like, ah, I don't know, I might paint it just to paint it to sell it. But I don't know, it's a bigger baby, but we'll see. Um, I don't know. I'm just excited about painting and just everything. I just, I don't know, I love it. I love when I talk to my um, customers and they're enjoying their babies and stuff. So, oh, just so much stuff is going to be coming up. So, love you guys. Have a great day. This has been a long video. I don't know when I'm going to get back on. So, until then, take care of yourself. Self-care is the best care. And we'll see you guys later. Bye-bye. Here's a few photos of when Andrew first got his hair brooded. And I was cutting it. And so I was washing the loose hairs, which I always do when I cut my baby's hair usually. So, um, yeah, I just thought I would add them in. That's all, folks. See you guys next time. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up.